Being a professional photographer is not only about creativity and technical skills, it's also about planning, location scouting, casting the right model and bringing lots of gear you are familiar with. But sometimes you just have to forget about all that and go out for a fun day of shooting just for yourself. No plans, no models, an unfamiliar location and a piece of equipment you've never used before. My buddy Jean and I went to the beach for such a fun day of shooting and to test drive my brand new California Sunbounce Micro Mini Reflector with the flash attachment. First thing to do was to find some nicely tanned bare skin. LA, Venice Beach. Lighting the subject with a flash attached to the Sunbounce Micro Mini allowed me to drop the background to a more dramatic level. City with no soul, winds without a still. Beneath the sunny surface rage a thousand stormy wills that have Jean really wanted to find a cuter model pills that make you the best you can be What do you do when your dream drives you crazy and the sun shines way too bright Can't get lazy if you're gonna get famous They tell me it can happen overnight so I'm fighting stronger it was our cameraman Didier who spotted our next victims. They probably just agreed to model because we saved them from a kid that was trying to make a move on one of them. Or maybe even on both. Sorry to ruin your day, man. It's kinda hard to find some shade on the beach at noon but eventually we found this spot. Sleeping with parties where I need to show. It's not about the talent, but about who you know. So I'm bored by the boardwalk, but I'm on TV. One of the reasons I like working with flash on location is because it allows me to control the light on the subject and the background separately. Everyone in LA knows what it's like to be real hungry. I see you and me, I see me and you. Crawling through the maze for a dream that might come true. Even with just natural light, you can often have control over the foreground versus the background. Jean used the sun as a backlight, and by letting me hold the reflector, the sun becomes a brighter main light too. And the sun shines way too bright. Can't get lazy if you're gonna get famous. They tell me it can happen. You can also use the reflector to block the direct sunlight and achieve a soft look on a sunny beach. Still in the game, don't you understand? Every time you kick me down, I come right back up again. Every time you kick me down, I come right back up again. The sun bounce proved to perform really well in high winds. The only problem was to prevent the one holding it soaring off the pier. I'm fat and dirty because I am. Still in the game, don't you understand? Every time you kick me down, I come right back up again. I spotted this worn out blue door that would make for a nice background. To prevent it from blowing out, I increased the shutter speed and added some flash on the subject. I'm Everything is golden because I when you're living in a I'm fighting dirty. By then, we were so famous on that beach that we didn't have to look for new models. They just came to us. Open shade can yield great results, but a touch of directional light often gives the picture that little extra spice. I come right back 